Well, that's the big question for you, Joe, and that is, is she better off playing rope dope She didn't campaign for a long time, didn't say she's a candidate, still isn't saying she's a candidate, hasn't gone on the offense, has accepted these blows. Would she have been better off running an aggressive, aggressive, offensive campaign against the Republicans from the day they started attacking her? Would it have made any well, difference? Well, I mean, I, Hillary's problem is Jeb's problem. They, they both are allowing others to define them. Hillary's problem, though, is not Rush Limbaugh or the National Review or the Wall Street Journal editorial page. It's that they're attacking New York Times reports. They're attacking Washington Post reports. They're attacking Wall Street Journal reports. And there are a lot of questions out there that she can't answer right now, that she doesn't want to answer right now. And so she's sitting back and she's on the defensive. And if she can get out and explain a way to serve, if she could get out and explain a lot of the foundation issues, I'm sure a lot of these numbers would change. Uh, Jeb, though, has the same problem. Jeb is on the defensive. He's, he, he's fumbled around on George W. Bush being his top advisor to the Middle East. And you see a tale of two safe candidates who are actually seeing their numbers tank. It reminds me of what happened to Giuliani and Hillary at this time during the cycle in 2007. Uh, and it's the same problem. For Jeb to be losing support among evangelicals and moderates at the same time is very tough for him. For Hillary to watch her numbers, and I, I wrote, wrote them down the Washington Post, her numbers for women under 50 dropping from 72 percent to 48 yeah. percent, it's pretty staggering. And both of these campaigns are too safe. They need to, uh, to, to start, start getting aggressive and punching back or else they're going to see those numbers fall and they're going to see the same problems that set in with Mitt Romney setting in with them. Well, let's take a look at those numbers. Jeb's been knocked